Okay, Debbie. You got this. Yeah, I, I, okay, uh, yeah, I figured out completely what happened here. They had the um, specter, or the the wraith, down here. Mm-hmm. Using all the filth down there to expose it to that filth. And then they came back up this road. They were... Then these guys, it's a blind corner, see? Mm-hmm. It's a blind corner. So, man, all three of them had to come here at the exact same right time. Yeah. The news van, the uh, Orochi, who must have come from the north. There was a camp up yeah. there, remember? Yeah, yeah. And then these guys were going to come back this way, but they thought there was a blind turn. These guys tore down the road. They... Veered off the road, containment breach. These the reporters pulled off the road to run. A Roshi guy got out of the car, and then whatever, and then the specter attacked him and killed him. Yep, it's fucking bad luck to be in a Roshi. Basically, is is the moral of the story here. That is exceptionally bad luck. Oh, the factory is what we saw earlier. Oh, okay. What I want to know is, why is the CDC van at the Franklin Mansion? That's a good question. I'll have to ask the CDC when we get there. Mm -hmm. Put them on a later list. Oh, you said that. You haven't said that in a while. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know. I don't want to wear out my catchphrases. Yeah, I mean, they get annoying. I mean, just... If I just say the word bazinga. Yeah, see? See? That was involuntary. You didn't even think of doing that. When I was there, the Illuminati was thinking of turning that into a memetic weapon. I can definitely see that working. Yeah. So, okay, so the Bigfoot want me to... Oh, yeah. The drum. They gave me a drum to signal them. Huh. Oh, I see. They want to give me scrap. They want me to get scrap metal so they can make weapons and armor. Oh, man. The Illum I mean, the, the Sasquatch are a lot more savage than the Illuminati thought. Yeah. Guerrilla warfare. Uh, uh <laughs> Oh, oh, they got, got here, here quick. quick. Jinx. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh... Oh, hook the hornet's nest again. I mean, it's a good thing you brought some friends this time. I'm almost as tall as them when I am. Um, he has that ability. No, you're not. Hey. Look, you'll see. I'll do it again, you'll see. You go up to, like, nipple height. Well, it's a lot closer than I am right now. <laughs> See? Okay, maybe I'm not. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I think that one... Is that one shorter? I think that one's shorter than the others. Yeah, he's shorter. Mm -hmm. Oh, he used, to, he used to run to the litter. Yeah. He's the nerdy Sasquatch, the one who gets picked on by all the by all the jocks. I don't think this, this Sasquatch pick on. They have him picking picking up the best pieces of uh, uh, armor. Well, weapons. yeah, that's because like after you get out of high school, nerds become important. I don't think Sasquatches have high school. Look, it's a, it's a metaphor for Sasquatch. Okay. 
I'm, um, what are they even digging for? Do they even know what they're digging for? Oh, no, they're like robots, you know? You just give them an order and they carry it out. Or is it just instinct? I mean, we've seen, like, like, Draug and, you know, stuff guiding them. Wait. You know, there's a bit of a pattern with these things, like the elder, the elder zombies. We only see them, we really only see them where they died. Or, like, where they are buried. Hmm. Did they bury people under these rubble? People who... Oh, what the fuck, Kingsmith? Or wherever we are? Must have been... Huh, look, an old wall. I wonder what that was a part of. Oh my god, I just noticed the title. The the, the the name of those monsters. What? Metallurgical Gear. Metallurgical Gear, huh? Metallurgical Gear! Okay, right, let me signal the Sasquatches. Signal the Sasquatches? What the? Oh. He doesn't want to go in there. Oh, that's... That's not reassuring. Fine, I'll get you this stuff. Scaredy ape. I gotta do everything. You don't gotta do shit. I was speaking as you! I can perfectly capable of speaking as myself. Thank <laughs> you. Yeah. There we go. Oh, yeah, he dropped a good deal of scrap metal. I mean, you'd think you'd get more than that, though. Oh, that's. Oh, that's a good group of them. Oh, uh... that's a big one. Okay. Well, I, th I think we found the supervisor. Well, I I complained to him. Yep. With a with a pickaxe. But well, hold on a shit. You just say hold on a shit. <laughs> yes, I did. And you know what? I'm going with it. Okay, that's okay. This time I see it. That's a fucking red hand crate. What the hell? These things came from the corner. I wonder. And they're here. Yeah, they're building golems. Interesting. Mm. Not gonna think about the implications of that. Okay, now I gotta find the um. Sasquatch, see where see where he went. Yeah. Oh, that's another big one. Oh Jesus! Is that uh, a is that a filth golem or what? We've we've run into those before. Uh. They're bent. They're like super mutated zombies, like made of fit. Like they're they're like the evolution of this thing. Okay, yeah, I like can see that. Ones. You can see it was still wearing its Hulk pants. <laughs> Just me or are the golems getting bigger? They are definitely getting bigger, and this one is currently asleep. Oh, oh, okay. So too soon. <laughs> See, I was thinking it could have just been, like, a coincidentally similar, uh, you know, garden sculpture. 
I'm not that lucky. What you have in your mouth is art! <laughs> okay. Okay there, buddy. Got brought up the stuff. I know the monsters were scary, but we're here to help. And um, it's just... Okay. Bye. Just leaving us to me now, huh? You know, the Sasquatch are noble people living in harmony with Gaia, but they're also kind of jerks. Oh! Yep. I just didn't want to go in there for some reason. I mean, I, I don't know why yet. I still don't know why. Hmm. Oh. We may never know the ways of the Sasquatch. Whoa, these guys really do not want them taking the metal. What have they got against Sasquatches? Hmm. I mean, have you seen their shift leader? He's like a 20 foot tall zombie hulk. Oh, wait, look, there's, these guys have come from. There's more than one era of Miner here. Oh my god. Must have been like successive clash. I mean, cave ins. They just. Everyone got buried together over the years. Holy yeah. shit. Okay. Help out any time, big guys. You're not gonna you're not you just leave this one to me, huh? Okay. I totally had it! I don't need your help. Hmm. Do it. Do it. I want to get... Let's see what's in the central area that was so freaking them out. Well, hey. Okay, kinda, that's... That's a... Uh, there's a Sasquatch! Oh. With... And these tentacles on the ground. That's not... Wait, okay. I mean, like... Phoenicians. Oh, no. What are they doing here? Initiate the secret histories... Mesopotamia, the Tower of Babel. From its top, two brothers ruled all they could see. They could see all. Enter a woman. Her beauty will inspire myths. Her eyes are a prelude to the fall of empires. Her parted lips promise secrets. And the tidal pull that causes men to steer their ships onto jagged rocks. Night to night she visited each brother. Promises moaned. She taught them jealousy, distrust, and covetous thoughts. Yeah, this one's infected. I didn't know that could happen. I thought they were in harmony with Gaia and protected by anima and all that shit. Well, sometimes you get you get fucked by tentacles. Seriously, never teach an ape the fundamentals of empire. I guess you think you're enabling their constitutional right to bear arms, but either you haven't watched enough movies or you've watched them too many of them. Still, if Orochi Black Ops Squad can't contain this outbreak, my money's not on stop signs and trash can lid shields turning things around for Camp Bigfoot. We'll call this a charitable write-off, and maybe you can refocus on saving things with a dollar value attached. Deal? Fun fact, the agency had a program training chimps to fly unmanned drones. Okay, then. You know, the first the first thing I thought of there was Buster Bluth. Mm -hmm. Is there one over here? Oh. I mean, Sasquatch is very elusive. Our wisdom flows so sweet, taste and see. Transmit, initiate the crypto signal. Receive, initiate the Semequay's call. Simply the call of the wild personified. Which some natures hear to their own destruction. Illumine the local legends of New England. Witness the Sasquatch. 
Okay, it looks like the military was scouting this place out and it did not go well. No, it did not. It very much but, did not. Okay, I thought there was something else here near the, um... Now that, before we leave here, I want to go back and check on something. Okay. Near where I found the crate. Alright, yeah, there's still a... What is up with that crate? Why are why are they here? Maybe that's something to do with the, why the bees told me about the Phoenicians. Oh god! <laughs> I don't know. I'm just I'm just you know throwing stuff out there. Yeah. Maybe it's all a cover for the, for the Phoenicians. I mean, maybe communism is just a red herring. Whoa. Whoa. Uh, oh, fuck. You don't even know what I'm saying oh fuck about. What, to the machine operator with the flamethrower? or? No. No, no. That's, that's kind of old hat by now. Okay, yeah, good point. This. Oh. Oh, my God. What the fuck? There's rats. God, rats all over the place. Uh, rats all over the place! Another one of these things. One of the rat ones, too. Those seem to be rare. Did they kill these people? They look like they're... They don't... They look like... Some of them have been dead longer than others. And then definitely doesn't look like they did it to themselves. Yeah, there's no, I mean, they have they have nooses around their neck, but that's no way they climbed up there. Yeah. I think the Re revenant must have done it. No, it does. I thought the revenant just appeared where things like this happened. I don't know. Maybe they did s commit suicide. I mean, what if this was a? I don't know. I just don't know. This is fucked up, and there's no good answers. Hey, there's another Franklin Mansion. Ah, fuck it. Oh, okay, I gotta get it all the way over there. Thanks, bees. You're my making this really easy. This would be so much easier if we had jetpacks. Um, I've actually tried a prototype of one. Yes, I saw your YouTube video. I just could not... You didn't get me, like, two feet off the ground. What the hell? I'm not that heavy. Well, it's kind of like, you know, technology from different ages is fundamentally incompatible. It's like science works differently now. No one, no one, no one really knows what that means. Initiate the secret histories! The house was born on Sullivan Island in 1876! An inverse birth. It came to be when others entered its belly. Frank and Joanna DeVore. They invested in the Blue Ridge Mine, and Frank was there to work as foreman and business overseer. The couple was popular. The soirees were lavish. The house was lively in its infancy. Shudder at the voracious things that grow from adorable larvae. I guess I've assessed the threat here. The larvae comment seems odd. I mean, the, these are bees. They, they shouldn't be so against insects. Well, they're biomagitech bees. Well, still. Yeah, they probably hatched from, like, cyber eggs and turned into techno larvae until they compupupated. That's, uh... Yeah, I'm not proud of it. Oh. Something's coming after me here. God, what is the hell? What is with this thing? It's regenerating somehow. Yeah, why? And it stopped, though. Okay. 
I guess I, I found its weakness. Hit it very hard. <laughs> we know their weakness. Without their heads, they're useless. <laughs> That's true for most things. What's that from? You're going to kill me. Yeah. Is from Scary Movie 3. <sighs> yeah. 